Hello, everyone. Thanks for joining. And we are going to go over the card today at Gulfstream for December 29th, um, Thursday. I'm going to start in race one. Race one is uh, one of the slightly more interesting races of the day. I think they have the wrong favorite with Mosler's image. Uh, this horse doesn't look too great to me. I would say the uh, most likely winner of this race is the shipper from Woodbine. She's the North. And uh, Wicked Mercury also has a shot, but the real value here is the eight, Machizima, coming in low weight. And this horse uh, looks pretty good. It's also shipping from Woodbine. It's coming off a claim, so there's question marks involved, but uh, at 15 to one, this is one of the better values on the day. Also, the six, Chica Boom, I think is uh, definitely worth, uh, worth adding, worth using. So uh, I would toss the one, the favorite, and I would use Machizima with Wicked Mercury. She's the North and Chica Boom. And uh, if you're playing pick fives or things like that, definitely She's the North has to be used. It's the most likely winner. So Machizima is the value, but She's the North is the most likely winner. And Wicked Mercury and Chica Boom are the only other horses I would use. Second race is a little bit of a mess. I don't really have much of an opinion here. Looks like the favorite is a little too short. Not sure why this is eight to five. The four last dream at five to one is probably the value of the race, but it's not a race that I'm looking at getting involved at all. Doesn't really seem like uh, there's, there's much value. Race three is another one of these races. It's kind of a wheel. Everyone has a shot. I think they have the wrong favorite with Mundo Mix, but there's not really a lot of value here. The odds are pretty correct. And um, if I was using a pick five or something, I would probably wheel it, maybe toss the one, or maybe toss the six, the favorite, but not such a great value race. Race four is, uh, uh, they have definitely have the wrong favorite here. Not sure why the seven is short, so short. There's not a lot of value. Uh, the second and third choices are the four Papa Cats is probably the most likely winner. And the one trap the win is probably decent value at nine to two. If I was playing this race, I would probably box those two, box the one four. They're paying 35 or 40 bucks. Not such a great race to get involved in, but I would definitely uh, toss the favorite. It has a chance, but it's just very, very, uh, very overpriced. Race number five. Race number five is a two-year-old race on turf. And these are the kind of races we try to stay away from unless there's some standout value and there's not. The favorite is the fastest race on turf. It's probably the most likely winner, but with all the unknowns and trying turf for the first time, it's a race that we just don't get involved in. And I would probably just wield it in any, uh, any multi-race bets. Race number six. Race number six has an interesting horse. Um, the favorite, the North remembers, is definitely the most likely winner and needs to be used. The other horses, though, uh, don't look great. And there's two long shots. The other favorites, I should say, don't look really any better. And the value in this race is the number two, Incitatus. Incitatus uh, coming off a couple non-stellar performances. But if you go back before that, this horse is one of the fastest horses in the race. And he's shipping from somewhere. I'm not sure exactly where. So maybe that's why there's a poor morning line. But this is one of the values of the day at 20 to 1 and must be used. This horse can definitely win this race. The other horse to use is King Theo, the 6 at 8 to 1. That's some great value. I wouldn't use any of these second or third choices. Kitten Spa, Heat of the Night, Dazzling Truth. I would definitely focus on the two in Citatus and use it with one, the North remembers, and six, King Theo. And for multi-race bets, I would use all three of those. Race number seven. Race number seven, they've got the right favorite here. Scarlet Stripe is not really a lock, but kind of a lock. Uh, the second choice, American Tap, is the only other horse that has a shot. You could try boxing them or betting a one-way exacta. But um, I think that uh, Scarlet Stripe is probably going to win. And I would, I would single it in most of the uh, multi-race bets. If you're playing a pick six, it's a little too short to single. You might want to try American Tap. It's a horse race, anything can happen, but I definitely wouldn't go any deeper than these two. Race number seven 
is, uh, or sorry, race number eight is uh, just kind of a spread race. There's nothing exciting. There's, there's no value. If you're using a multi-race, pick four, pick five, pick six, you've got to use a bunch of horses, the two beach nut trophy, the three sweet enough, and the three sweet enough at six to one is probably the value of the race but it's a tough race. The four, my candy girl, actually four, my candy girl at eight to one is probably the value. And the seven rosebuds hope the favorite or the second choice has to be used. Um, I think they have the wrong favor with lady day. I cannot understand this horse just doesn't really look like it has much of a chance. So as I'm talking through this, maybe the race isn't so terrible. Maybe, maybe um, a two, three, four box beach net trophy, sweet enough in my candy girl. Um, you could throw the seven rosebuds hope in there, but uh, yeah, two, three, four, a decent value, especially the three, four. So watch the board. And if these horses are long, it's decent. If they get bet, then it's not worth it. And the last race, the last race we have um, pretty straightforward race. A lot of horses in this race don't seem to have a chance. I think it's a Q, the three hot Bodhi and the four California Gigi. These two will probably come in one, two, and, and they're actually decent value. Um, they are the faves, but the, the, um, they're not big faves at four to one and nine to two. And um, the two Rosa star is the only other horse I think that kind of has a shot. So maybe box those three in the exactas or tries and use those three in the multi-race bets, uh, or you can just focus on the three, four in those bets. And that is it for today. So thanks a lot for joining and uh, good luck.